you may be forced to cough up up to 8 million shillings if you damage infrastructure along the expressway that will be open for use by the public next Saturday. Well, an administration manual outlines the use of the road, showing that motorists involved in accidents along the expressway will have to dig deeper into their pockets rather, to cover for any damage on the road, including towing fees, which range from 4,000 shillings and 40,000 shillings, depending on the class of the vehicle. President Uhuru Kenyatta, who announced the opening of the expressway starting Saturday next week, said the trial will help no possible challenges to be faced by the public while using the road. Chabatai Goin reports. Here in Westlands, Nairobi, construction workers are busy putting together a footbridge along the expressway. This being part of the last minute details being put on the road ahead of its trial run. The road, one of President Huru Kenyatta's legacy projects, as his 10-year term draws to a close. On Saturday, on a trial basis, tutaanza pia sasa tutaifungua ki, sio kirasmi, on a trial basis. Kwa magari, wanainchi waweze kuitumia, na ndiyo tuangalie sehemu ambazo zimebaki za kutengenezwa tengenezwa. But before its official opening, motorists have been put on notice. Any damage on the expressway will cost an arm and a leg. A manual that is set to be released to the public showing that any damage to the cantilever variable information board, which provides information on the direction a vehicle is headed, will attract a fine of 8.8 .8 million shillings. Damage of the ticket issuing machine and the scan recognizing the vehicle type will attract a fine of 1.9 million shillings and 2.4 million shillings respectively. Damages to a toll booth will range between 1.32 million and 1.8 million shillings. Destruction of the camera installed in the toll collection plaza will cost over 600,000 shillings in fines. In case of an accident, damage to a streetlight will cost between 143,000 shillings and 262,000 shillings depending on the type. If your vehicle stalls on the expressway, you will be forced to pay both towing and hoisting fees, whose rate will be determined by the towing distance and the class of the vehicle. For instance, vehicles under class 3 will attract a hoisting fee of a little over 32,000 shillings and a towing fee of between 4,000 and 12,000 shillings. For class 4 vehicles, the towing fees are between 6,000 and 17,000 shillings with a hoisting fee of 40,000 shillings. For class 5 vehicles, the towing fee will range between 10,500 shillings and 23,000 shillings. The hoisting fee will be 50,000 shillings. For class 6 vehicles, which comprise the heavy-duty trucks, towing fees will range between 20,000 shillings and 40,000 shillings. The hoisting fee here, pegged at between 70,000 shillings and 140,000 shillings. If a vehicle involved in an accident is parked in the designated parking area on the expressway, the motorist will pay for the duration of the parking. The rate will be determined by the class of the vehicle. Kenyans tempted to write graffiti on the road will attract a fine of 2,362 shillings. Other acts that will attract penalties include damage to the concrete pavement at 6,592 shillings, scratches on the pavement, damages to the culvert, guardrails and the signboards among others. And ahead of the opening of the expressway for the trial run, some said to be displaced are lamenting. <laughs> The 27-kilometer road is expected to go a long way in unlocking the traffic snarl-ups usually witnessed along Mombasa Road. Chamutai Goin, Citizen TV, Nairobi.